unplugging the Philips Azure, the blue light flashes twice and then the uh, iron switches off. So that's a very common problem. It is caused by this auto off circuit. So we are going to repair this now. First you need to remove this uh, blue uh, handle. So remove this uh, little lid by with your uh, nail and then remove this uh, hex screw from there. And then carefully you need to remove this uh, light blue handle uh, plastic, okay, uh, the covering the handle as in the, as in the video, just gently, okay, and push carefully, slowly, and then that's it. There's no wiring inside, okay. Now this is the, this is the uh, faulted circuit. We are going to cut this off. We are going to connect this uh, brown and, uh, and the red uh, wires. Okay, uh, the, the blue wire we don't need it, just cut it off and then tape it out. Okay, so this is the main trigger. Uh, okay, so you need to connect the, the, the brown and the red. And then uh, carefully place it uh, onto the handle again. And uh, if, if everything is properly placed, when you are moving this, uh, the, the switch, it should make a click, click, click sound. Okay, if it is not making this, if it is loose, then you need to remove it and... Uh, and place it again. Now we plug the iron. Now the I turned on the, the heat. Here we go. It's working now. Let's wait uh, to see if the if the thermostat is working. The light should go off soon. And uh, Here we go. So the your iron is fixed now. Yep, your iron is fixed, but it doesn't have. Uh, you, you can see the steam uh, in the video, but uh, there is no auto off uh, feature anymore, so it's not gonna be working. But everything else is just working fine. Okay, it is um, actually some people don't like the auto off function, so that's another way of removing it. Make me understand, Vangelis. We are sir.